Mike got me right this morning, getting all the tools and equipment ready. Oh yeah. So uh, go ahead and get inside. We're gonna actually continue doing what we were doing yesterday. I'll set this down real quick. Gotta finish getting this foam up on the ceiling because uh, that one panel fell. And then we gotta get the few ran over on these couple rungs. And then as soon as we're done with that, um, I think Mike's putting in a little ditch right here to bury this line. And then uh, we'll start putting up all the rock wool on all the walls in here. And uh, really start making this place feel like a home and less of a, a building in the yard. <laughs> Popping with you guys. Um, catch you while we're out here working. But today's going to be a busy day. Let's get Let's at it. Let's do it. Come on. Little update, we uh, just finished getting the rest of the insulation up on the ceiling. And then uh, went out there with dad, recorded for him, uh, for, for his channel, getting some rock on the tractor. And now, he's getting in on some grunt work, digging. Leveling out the ground here a little bit before uh, putting all this rock down and making this look all pretty. Mike's over here running some wire. Yee. Ooh, and we like them pretty now. Come <laughs> on. As he said it, we're going to get it right. So I think I'm probably going to go get on the bad end of a shovel, and um, I'll, I'll catch you guys over uh, probably on the GoPro. Oh, how the tables have turned. <laughs> well, see, the thing about it is, is son, this right here is how I get my exercise oh, up yeah. here on the mountain. Yeah. This right here gets the glutes, the hammies, yep. the tries, All of them. the bias. Woo, and it even makes for a thunder thigh. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> We got all this rock in here just about finished up. I'll give you guys a little 360 of the room and all the edges um, here in just a second. But uh, we're about to take ourselves to lunch, uh, go inside and make some peanut butter and jelly sandwiches. I've actually been, uh, so I've probably seen the AirPod in here, a lot of times it's music, but today I've been trying to practice on my Spanish. We're getting better, but I'll show you guys the rock and then I'm going to make a peanut butter and jelly. We're
we're back in the same spot with a different t-shirt just like the way every other video started here <laughs> but uh we are getting back on the tiny house project today we have uh changed the directive a little bit so initially we planned on getting up the rest of the rock wall today and getting the rest of the insulation up but long story short dad didn't wake up we had other stuff planned stuff didn't work out you don't have the rest of the rock wool and all the stuff that we do need so dad ran to town um, he's going to pick up actually that stuff rock wool and whatnot um, but while he's gone doing that going out to town he'll be a while uh, Mike is currently finishing up the rest of the electricity and getting all the outlets and uh, switches done and I'm cleaning out all the garbage and here soon I'll be sweeping all the floors to get it ready to paint and uh, as soon as we get done with that I'll be working on getting the first coat of primer down uh, followed by some paint and then we have some paint chips um, that we're going to be sprinkling down on top of it one of the little bags of paint chips did get uh, messed up though that's one of the fatalities i guess from uh the big rainstorm that came through but uh shouldn't be too bad today um here's hoping that doesn't stir up too much dust and get my my sneezing going non-stop but uh other than that not worried about too much so let's get behind a broom and start sweeping stuff and picking up garbage. Good though. Woohoo, look at that. Uh, leave a thumbs up to say uh, how good Mike's doing. Down in the comments say, You're doing great, Mike. What a great electrician. You're so good at everything you do. Woohoo! Tell him. So good at everything. <laughs> Even when I mess up, I do it so good. Exactly. Usually it's on purpose, just to keep you guys on your toes. Yeah, right. <laughs> We're off to a great start. We got a. Uh, bunch of the stuff taken out there's more hidden up over here more out here garbage garbage and inside we done got everything up got the rugs the mats um, I still got to grab the sink but I can do that in just a little bit I can go ahead and start sweeping out um, the rest of this and I'll uh, grab the dustpan and get all these little uh, wire clippings and all that kind of stuff um, in the dustpan throw it into the garbage bag and uh, yeah, start getting her cleaned up and ready to paint. Probably throw you guys on a time lapse of uh, me sweeping. So, see you there. Um, I actually just got this entire perimeter here around the bathroom all trimmed out with uh, the primer that we need to seal everything down with the paint. And now Mike's over here doing the bedroom side. Getting it in, getting it in. Well, I actually have no idea where I left this video off, so I just found my camera here sitting up and we started the recording. We went ahead and took ourselves a nice little break. Uh, we got the first coat down of all the rubber everywhere, but we got all of it primed. I uh, went inside and actually did the live stream, and I want to say thank you for many of you. I know that you, you're on both channels. Thank you so much for everyone uh, who went and subscribed to my second channel, which I believe I still have yet to bring up on this channel, so uh, 
check it out. It's a uh, knowledge for breakfast. Come on, <laughs> come on, <laughs> over to my new channel. Um, it's knowledge for breakfast, my new second channel. It's uh, pretty much me talking about life and philosophy and psychology and stuff. I like it. Uh, I'm really excited about it. Uh, we actually broke 500 today, so that's in three days. Three days went from zero to 500. Um, seriously, I couldn't. I couldn't be more excited. I, I couldn't be more grateful and appreciative for you guys really showing up and showing out. Um, it, it really means a lot to me and I have really big plans for uh, the future. So thank you so much. I really appreciate it. Um, with that little excerpt uh, added to the video, let's get back to it. We're about to grab the paint and uh, start painting the floors and then we'll let it dry, come back for the final one and uh, that should be the end of the floors. So sweet. Once again, appreciate you guys. Love you all so much. Check out the new channel, Knowledge for Breakfast. Peace. We switched back over to GoPro because we're about to get back into the building. Um, I got the video started. I am currently looking for, there we go. Oh, that's a shim. Never mind. I'm looking for a, a paint stir stick. Not stir sticks, but they might be used as one here in just a second because I'm not finding any better options currently. All right, today the shim decided to be a stir stick. Let's go put it to use. The first coat is finally on the floor and it is looking good. I love like the light grayish beige color he chose and especially once we get a second coat on there and throw that uh, like the speckle flake, it's going to look amazing. Already huge night and day difference. I did the bathroom, as you guys saw on the GoPro, the time lapse, and uh, Dad managed to get the whole bedroom area. Mike was running around cutting with the, the actual paintbrush, but we got her done. Uh, we'll check back in in about uh, 45 minutes, maybe an hour, hour and a half, and then uh, come back and do that final coat before it's completely dark out, and then uh, get some good rest, because tomorrow it starts all over again. I'll catch you guys in like an hour and some change. We are back again. Right, Ryder. We're back again to do the next coat of paint. Here's hoping that goes well. Um, I don't imagine there being many uh, complications. Ugh. My sinuses are killing me, though. Ugh. I will say the Arkansas greenery, I understand it's the natural state or nature state, whatever. Ugh. I'm using my allergy medicine, and it's still like, ugh. But we're powering through. Let's go paint that floor. Whoop. Time to take the Crocs off and then uh, start painting. Get started.
we're on the last little stretch of uh, the coat here. As you can see, we, uh, we've we made some real good progress out here with the speckle and the flake. Did you say speckle? Woo! <laughs> yeah, we're getting it done. But we're on the last little portion now. So uh, let's go ahead and tie this up. Careful, Levi. You might get grounded again. I'm just trying to paint, man. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like I need to get another shit to organize. <laughs> man, look at these floors, though. Wouldn't you say, Mike? I would say. Hey, look, it's you guys. Hey. Hey, look, it's me, it's you, it's you, it's me, hey. It's a it's a behind the scenes, behind the scenes look. Look, you can see you seeing me seeing you. What? <laughs> you know what I think? What you think? It's magic. Magic! <laughs> Good morning, gang. What seems to be a common trend for the, the trip here to Arkansas, the sinuses are going crazy this morning. But on that note, let's cut into some rock wool and insulation today. Woo! It's gonna be so much fun. All jokes aside, that is actually the plan for today. Um, get that rock wool pulled out. We're about to bring it over here into the building. I'll show you uh, here in just a second where, uh, where all that's going up. So as of right now, we don't have any specific area that uh, we plan to just get covered with a set amount of rock wool. We're going to use the three bags. It's uh, not convenient to store any of it. So uh, hopefully it can make it through the rest of the building. And if not, whatever's left, we'll, uh, we'll fill in with some, some other insulation. But uh, let's go ahead and grab these heavy bags, get them pulled out there, um, get me a little spot to cut up some pieces because I am going to need to make quite a few cut pieces today. With those square openings, I don't really like to fit just a sheet. Um, but on that note, I will catch you guys uh, cutting some rock wool and placing it inside the building. Come on. All right, we got the rock wool moved. Time to cut it open and uh, start cutting it to fit the wall. We're now getting started on this other wall right here. Oh, which you can't see at all, but now you can. But all I have left uh, is these two little squares here and then the two little halves that I need to piece together by the uh, breaker box wall. And then that's it for this entire section. And then I can either gonna move over to the other room um, or yeah, it's about my only option. I'll probably be moving over into that room. 
and uh, finishing up on that wall. We have officially finished the first bag of the three of the rock wool. Got some of the spare clippings there. Let me go ahead and show you how it looks on the wall. What you think, Ryder? How's it look? Oh, yeah, That's what I think too. Right yeah. But as you can see, um, it filled up a good bit of space on that wall. So uh, let's go ahead and bust open the other bag and uh, get back at it. We actually need to sharpen the knife up too, so let's go ahead and take the sharpener and uh, get that done. We are absolutely frying out here. Inside the building is a good bit cooler, which is nice. A lot of the insulation is helping with that. But the crappy part is, is I'm not in it. I'm out here cutting all of it and putting it in there so it's nice and cool in there. But. I get to sit in there and hang out for a second in between in between cuts, so it's manageable. But it's time to head inside. We're gonna grab some lunch real quick. I actually have to set up my live stream for tonight because um, today is Tuesday, and yeah, I'm ready to eat some food, get some water, get some AC, and then uh, get the live ready. Hopefully, I see a bunch of you guys, or hopefully, I did see a bunch of you guys in the live. Thanks for coming. <laughs> see you guys whenever we're back. Hopefully, it's cooler. We're back from the live. It went great. Uh, we had about 400 people in there, and um, we almost have the second channel up to a thousand subscribers, which I'm, I'm pretty sure we're probably gonna hit tonight. We were at like 980 or something in the live, so uh, thank you all, everyone who's uh, made it over to that channel. I greatly appreciate it. Um, and uh, yeah, we're about to get back on this insulation, get back to the tiny house, and uh, bust this out so we can call it a night. I'm tired. Come on. <laughs>